Hi friends, this is Chris with Josephine's Designs. I'm back with two quick hauls um, I just wanted to share with you. So, um, I am going to start first here with a Spellbinders kit. I've had this for maybe three weeks and I've just had it on my table and tried to get it videoed. So, if you don't know, Spellbinders has a variety of different types of uh, kits you can sign up for. And I'll try to look up and see what my kit is and I'll list it below. But I love these chipboard frames. I am thrilled to play with these. Um, it doesn't really tell you how many there are, but they're not super, super thick either. I think they're going to be perfect in memory keeping, junk journaling, things like that. Also, um, lots of dies. And I just think there's all kinds of word dies and, you know, florals. It looks like there's, um, oh, let's, let's peek at this one. Come on, I'm trying to hurry before my daughter comes back in. She's moving the car for me. But, so just so you can see, oh, look. Oh, these are so cute. Oh, for goodness sakes, those are cute. I don't know if you can see them. There's tickets, there's words, there's hop air balloons. I thought I saw birdie. Birdcage, all kinds of goodies. Feathers, dragonflies, hearts. Really fun. And then this gorgeous, this is called the Amazing Paper Grace. And it's Die of the Month. And isn't that absolutely breathtaking? I know. I don't know how long I'll keep doing this. I think once I get out into the cottage and have everything together, I'm going to go, oh, I'm going to use what I have. But in the meantime, I'm going to enjoy this. I really do like Spellbinders. They really do put together some fantastic kits. And um, yeah, it's just a real blessing. So, um, but I'll be through in just one second, honey. But this is um, a really neat, affordable way to begin your scrapbooking. If you don't use ephemera, if you don't have anything that either can create a frame or you purchase frames, then um, these are great resources. Now, dies require a die cutting machine, like a Big Shot or um, the Vagabond, but the Vagabond's being retired, any of those. Um, there's a Gemini, there's tons of die cutting machines now. When I started, there was like a cuddle bug, and then the Big Shot was a big deal. So, and the Vagabond, ooh, that was like amazing. And um, though I know they'll have other, um, I think there's a Gemini that's electronic as well. But most of them are kind of the hand crank, you know, that you crank it and then the dice come through with your paper and you cut it. But, um, yeah, and I have, um, gosh, I have a Big Shot, a Big Shot Pro. I've had the cuddle bug. I gave it to my youngest. Um, I've had several others and you know, they each have their pros and cons, but it doesn't matter. You can find them sometimes even at Tuesday morning. I know if you hit it just right. So if it's something you're ever thinking about doing, these are great starts to scrapbooking, card making, paper crafting. I mean, it just, the list goes on. So, um, and this is a very affordable way to do it. Okay. Now, last but not least, I placed a very sweet order. Um, it just killed me not to get in this. And I was hoping I wasn't going to damage this because I love this bag. You know, I'm going to use this bag. Um, but one of my teammates on, uh, with the, with DEK, um, had shared this, I think on her Instagram, and I immediately reached out to her and said, where did you get that? And so I jumped on over, and I think that's what this is. Let me see here. Oh, I love this bag. I'm going to use that. You know I will. It is. Look at these. These are rose paper clips. Are these not gorgeous or what? I absolutely love these. I think, oh, sorry, I didn't mean to shake the table. I absolutely love these. I think those are like the ultimate finishing touch on a page. So um, I wanted to share with you, uh, I will list the company below. Hold on. It is, because, oh man, I'm going to say it's Kubo and Lucy Stationery Company. Whoops. Kubo and Lucy Stationery Company. So very, very beautiful. Oh, she sent that. Isn't that sweet? That definitely can be used. 
And hold on, she's got something else here. Okay. Um, and then she included this little clip. Isn't that cute for summer? The palm frond on the paper clip. I love it. Super easy, super fun, super beautiful. And guys, it's these little touches that we add to our memory keeping pl uh, planners, our um, junk journals, our uh, cards that we make for others. I know. Um, our mixed media. So I just wanted to share a couple of encouragements that if you are new to scrapbooking, if you are new to um, paper crafting, card making, junk journaling, a planner, you know, planner, planner girl or planner babe, um, these are great tools to have. And I mean, you can even use these on your planners, guys. So so very thankful. Wouldn't that be so appropriate to add in on your planner? Seriously, how wonderful. Okay, friends, I hope you've enjoyed this. If you have, like, subscribe, do all that good stuff. Um, leave a comment. Tell me what was your favorite besides the bag. <laughs> I love this bag. <laughs> what was your favorite? I know it's really hard to pick. I think I have a favorite, but I'd love to hear what yours is. And um, yeah. And I look forward to talking to you again. I pray your day is blessed, creative, and lovely. I'll be talking to you soon. Y'all take care. Bye-bye.